gorgeous leather flat. It's one of those shoes that you would not wear all the time, but when you do, you know you're gonna get compliments. You know people are gonna be staring at your feet. Uh, I just think that it's a nice bougie flat. You know, like everybody's gonna have that same Aldo flat that you know that's that's so easy to find, and to find a white flat is very difficult. How annoying! Unbelievable. So this is my second YouTube day in the life. I want to do a shout out for my last video. Okay, well let's go with this one. Cutie Kawi 101. She says, Black Queen, I support your business 100%. Uh, so thank you, Cutie Kawi. I think what I'll start doing from here on is I'll do a shout out and a giveaway. So from this video, hopefully I'll do a giveaway. But I won't do it with every video, I'll just do it with some videos. But however you feel about this video, if you like this video, if there's some things you want to see a little bit more, comment down below and I will read, respond, and hopefully you'll be the shout out for the next video. Pokeball. Pokeball. Oh come on! I told you this last time you ordered this. I don't want. I, don't, I want meat. I want see salmon. Sure. I told you this last time. Yeah, but you liked it. I don't want that. I want salmon. I don't want and carrots and. Well, why did you tell me to order? How annoying! Unbelievable. is called the weekend flat so this is done with the constance logo which is built into the leather so this is not something that's printed on it's built right into the leather but it's a logo that you only really see when you're up close so it's not screaming it's not yelling at you as you can see they come with the foam base here that keeps the shape of the shoe as well as stuffing so that when it arrives it looks perfectly arched like that so these are genuine leather flats the logo on the shoe itself is printed on the insole. As I said, I make sure that all my shoes are padded on the inside so that they're extremely comfortable and you can be on your feet for many, many hours. You can be on your feet all day. Now here we've got double stitching on the inside sole. I make the sole of my shoes to be the same color of the shoe. If you notice a lot of brands, the shoe will be, uh, let's say white for example, and the inside will be a tan color uh, or a nude and for me, it doesn't complement everybody because a tan color is not nude for me um, and it's not a nude for everybody so I just go with the same color on the inside. The back is the first edition of our shoes. The back is done in our turquoise color at the bottom. The size is there. The rubber heel, I mean it's a flat shoe but it's you know it's about I don't know, half an inch off the ground which kind of gives that natural arch of the, of the foot. Sticking to the flats. I'm gonna show you the de jour flat. This is an everyday flat. This is a patent leather, just like the other one. This is a matte finish leather. This is a gloss finish leather. This is a super high quality shoe and it's made to shape this a C. It's not an obvious C. I mean, I could have gone with like a zigzag in the front or any other shape, but I went with something that's synonymous with the brand, which is C. And this one has constants embossed on the side here.
constants here is embossed into the leather this is something that will stay with the shoe for a very long time because it won't come off it is stamped into the leather itself it's such a high quality shoe just like the weekend flat if you see they're both so pretty what we did with this one here we went with a matte finish insole so that you don't slip and slide because even though it is leather if it's gloss you're going to slip and slide so that's the attention to detail that i've done to every little you know component of the shoe and the bottom is that beautiful turquoise blue as well so that is the de jour flat which means for the day which means every day it's the easiest slip on everyday black sandal all right this right here is a gorgeous gorgeous to me this is a classic shoe if you remember most women have a pointy shoe but it's usually a covered shoe so i wanted to do a hybrid something that is pointy which is classic if you're going to the office if you're a lawyer or you're going to court you know that typical classic pointy heel uh, but i wanted to make it open toe one because in south africa we have a warm weather most of the time so it's really nice to have something where your feet are not going to sweat and the heel we did it with a, a shiny silver i wanted something to contrast the black this, this is a shoe that's been trending this style was made popular by bottega but we did it a little bit differently the front shape is not exactly the same as bottega the mouth is not the same as well we went with a carved inside here but the mouth is actually more square than um, the way that bottega made their shoes uh, bottega also has their insole in a tan color i wanted mine as i said i like mine to match the actual shoe color so that your foot looks really slim and seamless with such a bright shoe the less Less is more, you know, when it comes to um, details. Stitching for this, we went with white stitching on the edges, and then here it's actually more of a darker tan stitching that matches the bottom heel. And because it's leather, it will be with you for many, many, many years. And we have a, a bag that complements this shoe, which I will show you in another video. Uh, it's summer, so if you want to shop, you want to shop Constance, you want to shop black owned, you want to shop women owned, you're going to get good quality. Sometimes I'll just lay back when I'm tired of sitting down. I'll just lay back somewhere like this and I'll do all the DMs, usually the Kobe DMs, because they're the ones that um, need a lot more like clarification between like ladies asking for the right size, asking how to find the right size, looking for recommendations, and I'll sometimes recommend that someone get something that is very different from what they originally wanted. 